This is going to be a quick tip video about the uh, world clock feature in Ubuntu. And uh, what I mean by the world clock feature is um, if you go to your clock on your panel and you click it, you notice that you get this calendar here. Now if you go to locations and expand that, you get a, a world map here. And you can add different uh, clocks for different time zones or different cities here. And you can uh, look at all of them at the same time. And to do this, you just uh, click Edit. And uh, this window is going to pop up. And uh, what you have to do here is uh, go to Add, click that, and type the name of the city that you want to add to uh, to your applet. So for this, uh, I'm just going to try San Francisco. So just start typing France, uh, San Francisco. And it should find it. And then just click that and it should pick the right time zone and uh, latitude and longitude. After you do that, uh, just click OK. And it should add it right here. Now you have a weather tab here. Uh, you can choose the temperature unit and the wind speed unit from here. So uh, I'm just going to leave this at Fahrenheit and uh, the wind speed I changed it to mile per hour. Uh, the other options you have here is uh, the clock options. You, you have uh, 12 hour format or 24 hour format. Or, and also you can uh, show the date and seconds up here in the panel if you want it. Uh, you can also show the weather and temperature. Okay, so now we added uh, San Francisco here, and you can see in the map it added a, a, a point here for San Francisco, and it shows you where it is in the map. And here, um, you can see here that in Detroit, the time is different than San Francisco, so it has the right time for each of these locations. The other nice thing about this is um, if you hover over the weather um, icon, it gives you more detail about the weather. So it'll tell you the, the temperature, uh, the wind, and uh, sunrise, and uh, uh, sundown. Same thing for uh, the other clocks. Now there are some cities here that are not, um, if you go to maybe some cities in Africa or or in Asia, I found some cities where they might not have the, weathers, uh, the weather for them. And uh, you might have to do those manually. And uh, you're not limited to just two clocks here. You can add more if you want. So if I go to edit and uh, add, I'm going to try some other location, maybe uh, let me try Tokyo maybe. So the same thing, just uh, OK. And it will add Tokyo here. And the time. You can see that 7.14 there. And uh, same thing, if you hover over, over the, the weather icon, you get uh, uh, the weather. And uh, another thing here, uh, you notice that there's a, whenever you go to the side here, there is a um, set button that pops up. So um, if I'm in Detroit and that's my, my time, all you have to do is click the set and uh, that button should turn into um, an icon of a house. And in the map, you can see that your location will turn into a house. What that means is that your, your uh, Ubuntu default time is going to be based on that location. So it'll show you the time for that location. Now, let's say uh, if I travel to San Francisco and I want my computer to use San Francisco's time instead of Detroit's time. Then what I would do is uh, go to San Francisco and click set and it should switch them. And now in my panel, it should show San Francisco's time. So you can use this uh, if you're traveling or if you do a lot of travel. Uh, this is pretty much it. Uh, uh, try it out and uh, thanks for watching.